Hi, Matt B here and welcome to M2M, the channel that burns the nonsense. And welcome to this new series simply called Moon Hoax, where I debunk the most common Moonland hoax theories, both old and new, from the era of Apollo from 1969 to 1972. If you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon, select all, and you'll be notified when I upload more videos. And if you'd like the video, then please hit the thumbs up. But the best thing for you to do if you comment below in each video, let me know how I'm getting on. And if there's any moon hoax theories that you'd like me to add, then let me know in the comments below and I'll look at adding it. So anyway, let's get on with the video and roll the credits. Number five, shadows on the moon appear not to be parallel. Some photographs taken on the moon during the landing show shadows that are converging. Conspiratards say that since light rays from the sun are parallel, any shadows cast by the sun should also be parallel. Shadows that are not parallel are said to be caused by studio lighting, either by a light source which is relatively close or multiple light sources, or even both. The fact is that converging shadows are a well-known optical phenomenon in photography. There is nothing mysterious about it. In fact, you can easily replicate this effect yourself as per this example. This photo, taken only with the sun as a light source, clearly shows how any camera will produce the same effect. This effect is caused by several factors, including perspective and the way the surface may be inclined or uneven relative to the camera and the light source. Now if this isn't enough for you, there are two important things to make note of, and here's the clincher that blows this theory out of the water and into the fire. Number one, multiple light sources create multiple shadows. Now do we see this in the Apollo photos on the moon? No we don't. Number two, a light source placed close to the objects would not create converging shadows. In fact, it would create diverging shadows. Do we see this on the Apollo photos on the moon? No, we don't. So you see, conspirators, this is yet another theory totally and utterly burned. <laughs> 